One, two, Freddy's coming for you. Three, four, better lock your door. Five, six, grab your crucifix. Seven, eight, better stay up late. Got the mind of a winner. You don't know the difference. See that hate up in your eyes, little buddy. What you sipping? Oh, you think I'm out of bounds? Then go ahead, blow the whistle. I can't help but turn the heat up. Let them watch me sizzle. Try to figure me out. That's a complicated riddle. Got an outside game, and I still can work the middle. Oh, I'm about to blow the speakers. Won't you crank it up a little? So what's going on, all my frag heads and set heads? The champ is here, and I'm about to tell you what's fragging. So what's fragging today is my man Barry over at Centralized tagged me in the video. This is for four monster performers and four monster projectors. So I wore a shirt just for you guys, as I always do. You know, how you like it? Eh? Eh? Little Freddy, you know, did you like, you like the intro too? I had fun doing that one. Um, so I'm going to start today with four monster projectors. So the first one I have is Armani Code Profumo. God, you talk about a Tonka bomb in vanilla. This is it like this. And there's maybe some leather in there too. Um, but I get some masculine. This is like Christmas party worthy. This is like chilling in a bar or a lounge with a good cigar and a good cognac in the winter time. And you kind of bundled up and somebody walks by you and they get like that leather jacket smell and that Tonka and the vanilla. This is just sexy. I love it. Um, now this thing does last long too, but it projects more than it lasts. So that's why it's on my projection list more than a monster performer. Um, it is more beast mode than anything else. So if you haven't tried this, get your nose on this. I mean, you are going to love this, especially everyone around you. They're going to enjoy this. So make sure you pick this up. The next one is going to be no other than Bogari Aqua Amara. Sorry for the light ring, guys. Um, so with this one, this is masculine as well. And I mean, projection, especially in the sun, you're going to choke yourself out, <laughs> especially in this Phoenix heat. Um, however, it is going to radiate through the entire room. There's not been one time I wore this and someone hasn't asked what I was wearing. What I get from this, of course, is the aquatics. You also get like that dirty orange, but it's not like, you know, a dirt orange. It's just more so like the orange peel more than the orange itself. Um, to me, it's reminiscent of if you put orange peels in a lake. That's what it reminds me of. As in, you know, when you're going fishing and you can smell the fish, but you smell the pond water as well, their lake water as well. That's what this is. You smell the lake water, but you also get that orange. It's very orange heavy. It's orange peel, not orange citrus, if that makes sense. But this thing, like I said, it just radiates. Every time I wear this, everyone asks, what am I wearing? And I'm wearing like three or five sprays of this. So I know this is a monster projector. Um, if you haven't picked this up, go ahead and pick it up. Um, it is one of my go-tos in the spring I do wear it in the summer, like I wore it yesterday just to try it out again for this video. Fell right back in love with it, man. Pick this bad boy up. Aqua Amara by Bogari. The next one I have, and I didn't even clean it off, but I featured it in my last video. So let me go ahead and kind of try to get some marks off this as good as I can right now. But another monster projector is going to be Paco Raban one million guys when i mean everyone gonna notice you when you step into a room everyone is going to notice you this thing has rose in it i believe it has tonka in it too i believe it has leather as well um i pick up a lot of cinnamon from it this thing is just lovely now they did recommend this as a clubbing fragrance like back in the day a lot of old reviewers um just because of the projection on it and like i said this gets everyone in the room this would open up nostrils why this doesn't get mentioned anymore? Well, because of the other flankers. But I think a lot of people just got tired of it. You know what I mean? But this is still great. Old 
but goody, man. This is definitely a classic and a staple in my collection. I don't care what anyone says. Um, like I said, once you walk into a club, once you walk onto set, or whatever you do to where you want to get that attention, this is going to bring it. Everyone's going to flock to you or everyone's going to say, what is that? That's going to be no other than Paco Rabanne, one million. My next one, I think I've seen on a couple list and deservingly so, but that's going to be Bentley for men intense. This bad boy, incense, leather. Oh my God. Cognac. I know it's a it's a liquor note in here. I really can't remember, but I want to say like cognac. Um, this is just elegant, man. This is for, like I said, a guy stepping out of a Bentley who's been sitting on those leather seats, smoking a cigar, tobacco's in there too, I believe, with incense going, you know, drinking a cognac. This is just great, man. If you don't have this, I don't know what you're waiting for. It's only 30 bucks, 25 bucks. Maybe you can pick this up and you will smell like a grown man and elegance this is like boardroom worthy i wear this to my boardroom meetings to be honest with you even though it has a boozy note to it no one picks up on the booze everyone says it smells like money and that's why i love wearing this so now we're going to go on to the performers first one up no let's not let me do one that's going to surprise everyone so that's going to be Chrome by Zaro. Now, I know what you're thinking. They have so many flankers now. They have Sport um, and the other ones as well. Um, United, they have as well. But this one right here, I mean, last all day. This is one of those fragrances to where um, after you work out and you have a long day ahead of you, spray this on and you're going to be good, right? This is like that casual setting. Um, it is metallic. You do get that metallic note. Or after a while, you're kind of like, okay, it's burning my nose hair. But this thing lasts for at least a great 12 hours on my skin, at least. It has never felt me in any situation. Like I said, right after the gym, spray it on. And if I have plans or other things to do, this is going to suit me just right. I don't have to pick up a fancy one or expensive one. Just boom, 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 boom. All day, it lasts. The next one. There's going to be another blue fragrance, and that's going to be Versace Dylan Blue. Now, it's kind of torn between this because it is beast mode as well. However, um, I just like the longevity of it more than I like the projection. So I wear this, for example, if I'm going to work and then I know I'm going to like a happy hour later or I know I have an activity going on after that and I still want to smell fresh or I want to smell professional. I rock this bad boy. Now, you, you do get like that Ambroxy feel to it, that typical blue new or mainstream fragrance now. But this is so lovely. I've had people tell me to walk by them a couple times while I've worn this. Um, and like I said, this thing lasts a good 12 hours. I can wear it all day through work. I can go to a kid's softball game or even, you know, just hanging out with a couple co-workers. And I know this won't fail me. I don't have to spray it on again. This is great, y'all. Versace, Dylan, Blue. The next one up ah, is my favorite, and I've mentioned this in other lists as well. I just love this. Armani, Stronger With You. Cardamom. Vanilla. My God. This is just elegance as well. When I smell this, it makes my eyes roll, guys. I mean, the experiences I had with this as well. Um, but like I said, you're going to get the vanilla and the cardamom bomb from this. And this thing lasts me all day. I sprayed this on a date once. Um, went to the date, woke up the next morning, still had it on my skin. Um, even when I washed it off, you can smell it in the shower as I'm washing it off. It's just one of those great fragrances, man, that's going to last at least 12 hours. Um, it is one of those sweet bombs, so it may be annoying to some who are into, like, the freshies. But I'm telling you, if you want to smell sexy all day or elegant all day, this is going to be the go-to. Armani, stronger with you. And last but not least, 
I've mentioned this in another video as well. I'll leave that video down below. Um, I don't see this getting a lot of attention. I have seen, I think it's House of Aroma. I'll leave his link below as well. He owns it. My man Uncommon Sense actually picked it up as well um, from one of my videos. But that's going to be La Venture by Al Hermin. What can I say? They say it's an Aventus clone. I don't get really a Aventus. I get more of a um, a fresher, a fruitier Aventus, if you want to put it in that category. I get lemon. Oh. Like it doesn't smell like lemon pledge or like a lemon cleaner. It just smells like a lemon, you know, but like a manly lemon and not really sweet, but like a lemon that's mixed with like floral. So I want to say there's probably Lily of the Valley or lilac in here, maybe even a lavender. But when I'm talking about last all day, especially in the summertime, yo, so I wore to work, right? And it was one of those days where I put an all nighter, came home, didn't shower or anything, woke up the next morning and went to my workout. As soon as I start working out, this thing just started to just heat up. I mean, and I can smell it to the point where I'm like, is that, is that me? Is that still on me? Yeah, it is. Oh my God. <sighs> Another one of those where if you know you have something to do that day, spray this bad boy on. It's going to last you forever. I need to pick up another bottle because I'm kind of running out on this one. Um, but yeah, they say it's an Aventus clone. I don't get Aventus really. Maybe similarities, but everything has similarities. I even heard that people smell rubber. But that's the dumbest thing I've heard because if you look at it, it's rubber right here. Right here, it's rubber. So yeah, that's the rubber <laughs> you're smelling. Um, but yeah, so that brings a conclusion to my video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the shirt as well. Make sure you like it. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you leave me a comment on what are yours, your favorite in these categories. Make sure you go follow my man, Barry. Um, and make sure you have a great day. Peace and blessings. The champ is out.